Thanks for letting me know that. It's right behind me the whole time. How you doing today? Welcome to Friday night painting with Belsif. Today on the show, we're gonna paint some brackets. I already started painting the brackets, but the blue I went with, no good. It looks like crap. Way too blue for this engine. Look at it. What happened? I don't think so, Captain. So I end up going to Canadian Tire, which is, you know, Canadian Tire here in Canada. I know that 65% of you are Americans that watch me, so Canadian Tire is like a Canadian Tire to you. It's like uh, Menards. There you go. So I went to Menards there and I found some paint with the same paint coat as my friggin' truck. Toyota Blue. What is the chances of that? Let's check it out. It's pretty friggin' close, Captain. Wait, the first thing you wanna do down here is you wanna take your bracket, if it's cold in your garage like it is in mine, and just heat it up a little bit. And you don't wanna paint on a cold surface. And you, and you wanna make sure you scuff up the blue paint. Now I'm not a painter, so I could be wrong. So leave me any comments down below. And you wanna make sure you get underneath it so you blow any dirt away. Because we're just hitting her right on the bench, we are. Oh, it's warm, it's getting there. It's almost ready. You wanna cook it at about 90 degrees. And then when you hit the paint to her, she should go on pretty smooth. But I could be friggin' wrong too. Cause I've been known to be wrong before. There we go. So we'll let that cool down for a second and we'll shut her off so you can hear me a little more. And we'll shake the shit out of the can. Yeah, we will. Probably look with my thing on the top. Pretty good? I bet I do. Oh, I can't stand these fucking lids. Oh, they're cold. What else you should do is just, you know, wipe underneath the surface just in case as well. Because you never know, you might get some dirt. Now I didn't wipe this down with nothing. I suggest you do the same, but we're gonna see what happens here. What the heck kind of nozzle is that, Jim? It's all crooked and cockeyed. It should only be one fucking, better check this thing. I don't even know how it sprays. Oh, dick. Watch this, boys. Well, that didn't fucking work too fucking good, did it? What exactly happened there? I'll tell you right now, it didn't like the paint that was on my friggin' stand, did it? It gave it the, how you doing freckle look. So we're gonna grind this down now. Because that didn't fucking work at all. Oh, I know why, the paint's still wet. Ow, careful. So if you ever do this like me, make sure the original paint you put on is dry. Cause that's exactly what happened. Let's just do that for now. The backside you don't need to worry about. Let's try it one more time. Grind it down, ready? Aw, oh, dick. Aw, oh, dick. Easy, not too much. Look at, look at, look at the shine on that, boys. Oh my God, that is gonna be beautiful. That is much better than that. Look at the difference. Friggin' right, we're gonna let that set up a little bit. Maybe add a little bit of heat to it. I wanna help it along a little bit, you know, especially in a cold garage like this. I'm starting this bracket first, cause it's low and you don't see it. Here we go, just a little bit of heat, not much. So now we'll grind this one back down. Unless it's dry, it could be dry. You know what, let's try it without doing anything to it. Scuffing or nothing, let's just try hitting it and see what it does. This will tell us a lot. You know what, I think we might be all right on that one. Friggin' right we might be, it's working. Wonder why that one was still wet. That's kind of dicker, Jim. So I'm gonna try just spraying it without touching it. What do you think? Let's try it on this side. Oh, no, there it goes. Frig. One of that from the rag. Let's just leave that for a minute and we'll have a good look at her again. Let's give this another one. Oh, that's, that's fucking awesome right there. That's a Catalina wine mixer. Just wanna put a little bit more on that, see what it does. So I guess we can do that, Jim. Paint it when it's wet, not when it's dry. Or paint it when it's not heated. Oh fuck, is that ever nice looking paint? Look at that coat. Oh yeah, we did. Friggin' right we did. That looks like gold. Blue gold, Jim. Come here, Mr. Carburetor Spacer. You're next. Ready? I'm not. Here goes nothing. 
Oh, dick. Oh, what happened? So that didn't work on that one. It doesn't like the trim clad. So that means I'm gonna have to peel every single one of these goddamn things. Unreal. Well, let's see, you know, you like the uh, kind of rugged look, eh? I don't. There's nothing more frustrating with paint that does that. It doesn't matter what you do sometimes, it just cocks you right over. And I've been cocked right over. Yeah, they're all doing it. So that ends right there. We gotta take everything back down to the metal, do it again. That's great. That's exactly what the dirty old bills have wanted to fucking do. How did I not know that? I'm swearing and cursing. I'm trying to paint some brackets and it's not working out too good. Fuck sakes. Okay, so we got one back down on the metal. Well, the primer. I used primerless primer on this thing. Or I used high build primer on this thing. Now I just took it all off, cocked it over. But we're gonna try to hit her again here and see what happens. You watching? I ain't. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh, hold on. Good. Okay, let's leave that and let it set up and we're still fucking getting that in some spots. Oh my God, Lord help us. Yeah, see, my phone even thinks so. So even though I friggin' grinded this back down, the little spots I left with primer or black paint on it, it's even lifted that. So, man, this is gonna take me a long time to do properly, I'll tell you. So as you can see, so far, the only bracket I have accomplished is this one right here. This one's no good again. I still gotta grind more off of it. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man, eh? Man, oh man. Just have to get serious. It should maybe paint now. I'm gonna go really thin coats this time. Just let it build up. Just like that. Let that tack up, and then we'll give her another hammer job. Let's clean this bracket off. Thank God I got all winter, because I'm gonna need it the way I'm going. We're getting there now. It's a matter of friggin' sanding everything back down again. Thank you for that. Where oh where is my fucking tape? Oh, oh where oh where is it gone? Should be an orange roll of fucking tape around here somewhere. Fuck no. Why would there be? I don't doubt I can find anything around here anymore. Guess we're using this tape. Oh, here it is. Duh. Thanks for letting me know that. It's right behind me the whole time. Jeez, where were you guys? Hey, eh? What's really going on? So instead of painting the surfaces I don't want painted this time, I'm gonna use some tape <laughs> to tape it off, which I should have done last time I painted it, but I didn't because, you know, that's just the way I work. What do you mean you don't wanna do things twice? That don't make sense. All right, razor blade. I got one here with paint on it. Will it work? Let's see. Ready? No, don't. That one's fucky. Garbage! I'm not talking right now because I'm concentrating. Well, I've been out here painting now for quite a while, as you know. <coughs> Pardon me. Without a mask on, so I'm half, you know, cocked over. But I got a coat on these and they look pretty good. 
And I got a coat on the, the bracket for that and this. And they even put a coat on the old water pump. It's dark down there, so you can't tell. But she got a slight coat on her just to offset the black a little bit in there. So I think all these brackets should look pretty good. Because they're not going to be overpowering now. Like that last... Oh, fuck. Careful. That last blue was so overpowerful and it was crazy. So look at that. That looks a lot better. Hey, now it just kind of blends the truck into her a little bit. We need some more on that side. We do. But anyways, that's what I've been doing. And I've been scraping on this thing here. Got to get that pulley cleaned up. But baby steps, Jim. Baby steps, Jim. That's all we can do. I'm quite happy. I'm happier with this color blue than I am the other blue. It's not as stick outy and toyish looking. It's more of a blender. I got the line ran, AN fitting ran there for the brake booster. So that line will go there and hopefully I get enough line to go from there, which I should have right here once I'm done that part. Can't cut any off more of that right now until we get that thing. Bob's your uncle, but I should have technically about this much more. So that will run to the brake booster and then she'll be braided. Right, right it will. But this is a quick video. I didn't do much tonight, just some a quick painting. I know the painting ain't that great, so I just wanted to show you what was going on. Hopefully everybody's having a good day. Thanks for being here. And we'll see you next time.